to the fourth part of the video guys we're now uh, present on the official website uh, of the Corsair uh, this, uh, this is the uh, the memory that I was telling you about 2 by uh, 4 gigabyte and in total that I 8 gigabyte 1333 C9 and now we're going to focus on the CPU-Z to show you a couple of things we see right now that the 16 gigabytes is 16 gigabytes pardon, uh, is present DDR3 1666.2 uh, we also know that if we multiply the 666 or 667 let's try making a calculation by 2 always uh, we multiply by 2 multiplying by 2 pardon uh, we do have the 1333 the frequency that uh, is supposed to be here so the frequency is present now what I want to show you here is uh, let's start with the slot 1 in slot 1 uh, we see very clearly that uh, this module of course is uh, having the 4 gigabyte and uh, into the right corner we see that the XMP 1.2 is present here of course it ranks by dual channel uh, we do the rest of the specs 9924 the 666 and uh, this is the series I was uh, telling you about uh, by the way this this is the uh, first slot closest to the CPU now if you move to to the second uh, we do have the uh, the same frequency the same specs as it normally should be uh, XMP 1.2 of course it's uh, ranked by uh, dual dual channel and now I'm going to show you the third slot of the memory and right now we see this is the single uh, right now the XMP 1.2 is not present anymore uh, this means that the this uh, memory module even though it has uh, 4 gigabyte is not uh, comparable with the XMP profile 1.2 uh, we also see that right here there are uh, there are missing uh, some of the specs like 777 like uh, the other ones were here let me give you a quick look 777 1927 which is quite weird uh, this module by the way I bought it Sunday after and I'm not very happy with it what can I say but it does work now if we move to the slot 4 we see that everything is fine right here the XMP 1.2 4 gigabytes of course is ranked by dual uh, this is the voltages and yeah so that's why it's best to buy uh, uh, pairs all the time uh, dual channel or triple channel it's very important to uh, to have the same serial number like shown here and of course the uh, SPDX for to be the XMP otherwise uh, you're going to have a lot of issues. Uh, my computer uh, yesterday uh, restarted uh, for some reason. Uh, they gave me some some of the errors. Uh, simply just uh, restarted. I believe there is a problem. Uh, there is a problem with the memory because before with my older ones uh, I didn't have uh, this kind of uh, issue. But yeah, this is the 16 gigabyte. I really needed that. Uh, the amount of memory because uh, it's best for editing and all of that the computer works flawlessly using this uh, 16 gigabyte uh, of memory yeah thank you for watching guys uh, see you next time bye